So it's time to try the treats from Kathleen and Sam. Which ones are you looking forward to the most? Obviously the fruit ox. The fruit ox are gonna be the best. I really want to try these. I'm All so right. excited for these with the raspberry on the inside. Which one would you like? Go on. Uh, let's go with mint first. Let's try the mint first. You, you'll probably like mint more than me. Yeah. I'm uh, not sure if you should put mint with chocolate. You definitely should. Just uh. Oh, they smell really okay. minty. They kind of smell like aero bubbles, but obviously not the same texture. Okay. They're really minty. It is like putting a mint leaf in your mouth. Um, They're really good. It's got the mintiness of an after eight. Exactly the same mintiness of an after eight in a smarty cross M and M M and M style mm. ball. Um, really nice though. Yeah. Maybe too minty for you. Just though. before bed. But after dinner, cleanse your palate. Lovely. I, I don't mind them. To be fair, I'd eat the whole pack of them. <laughs> I don't mind them. I think they're okay. The problem is the minty the mintiness might have ruined. Do you think we should nice. have a drink first? A nice, uh, loo. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Ah. It's just so good. It's so nice. Sorry, I know it's not Australian, but we had it in the fridge still. Uh, so yummy. Okay. Sorry for the little cat head that will keep popping up in the picture as well. All right, next up, let's try one of the chocolate chewy raspberry balls. I'm really excited for these. They're not quite as big. Oh no, they're quite small. But I think that's kind of better. They're the size of a... Slightly smaller than a Malteser. Oh my god. Boy, it's chewy. I love them. I really like the texture. Mm -hmm. Texture's really good. Could be it's more... It's gummy, but not too gummy. It could be more raspberry. -y. No, I love them. <laughs> I never know how to say that <laughs> one. Same with cherry. It's like... Hear me out here. It is like a natural confectionery gummy. Jelly. Wrapped in chocolate. Wrapped in chocolate. It is. It's exactly that. Really good though. It takes some time getting used to actually. The the textures. It's licorice. Is it? Raspberry licorice. But not all licorice tastes like aniseed, mm. does it? Really good though. I really like them. Or kind of the middle. It's also kind of like, you know, the flavoured pencil kind of things, that kind of gumminess. I want more You want flavor. more? Oh, see, I'm loving that. I want more raspberry. Let's try the white chocolate one, see if you get more raspberry from there. Okay. That's true. White chocolate. Uh, so I really, I'm a massive fan of white chocolate. And raspberry. This is like and your raspberry. dream combination. Oh. Similar size. No. Look at this one. Oh god, you got like a I got a double rectangle one. So that's instantly better because of the white chocolate. But I just want more. I, I want think more. I prefer them. Do you? I prefer this because the white chocolate is actually really nice. But I want more zing. I want more raspberry going pow. And it's really hard to eat quickly. I think they're really nice. But still prefer the milk chocolate because I like the taste of the milk chocolate a bit more than the white chocolate. Texture, really good, really interesting. It's not as much raspberry I as want, I guess I, I, we were expecting. I just want more raspberry. Because everything at my else face. we've had has been quite flavourful, hasn't it? Let's see if this raspberry is any more powerful. The bullets. Bullets. The little monkey. So we've had. Um, so Kathleen actually sent other stuff such as the. Cherry ripes. The Come cherry in. ripes, but we've tried them, so you can watch them in previous videos. Uh, the Rockley Road, which was incredible. This chocolate's always so thick, though. That's the one difference. We don't really get chocolate this thick. Yeah. If you can see it, hopefully. Um, and what I said about the Darrell Lee, I didn't think the chocolate was amazing, but what made it so good was the ingredients they put inside. So with the Rockley Road, all those ingredients merged well with the chocolate and actually 
I don't know if the word covering up the chocolate is, is a good way to put it. I like this. White chocolate's good. Mm-hmm. Once again, it's that gummy. But I like the crunch you get in it as well. Yeah, it breaks it up really nicely. You've got three different textures in this. You've got the melting chocolate. Which is very creamy, actually. For, yeah. It's a very creamy white mm. chocolate. You've got the gummy of the bullet. Mm-hmm. And then you've got the crunch of the raspberry chips, crunchy. Mm. It actually just says it on here. And actually, exactly, <laughs> what, it, exactly what it says on there. I, had, I didn't actually look at the wrapper. Creamy white chocolate. I picked that up straight up. Chewy raspberry pieces. Picked that up. Crunchy raspberry chips. But like I was saying about the chocolate, by having those different textures and flavours in the chocolate, it puts it on another level. Mm. Really good. Mm. Next. So I've had the mango. I'll put that piece away. I'll have another one because they're so good. Do you want another one? Yeah, I do like them. Okay. Just so the mango fruit chocks. Once again, I say this in every, I say this in every video. Did you eat that chocolate or put it away? I put it away so you didn't eat it. Okay, I thought he had eaten it. Um, <laughs> If you haven't tried this, they make it in South Australia, and you can order it, I think, but I can't over here. Anyway. So nice. Mm. I do like fruit But this is, this is the difference. Now, I'm not worried about the different textures, but the zing you get when you eat this and the mango just pops. Mm. I wanted that with the raspberry. Completely different textures, so, but I wanted that pop. I like these, but I think they're they're a bit too much. Too There's much. a bit too much overload, whereas this was just enough for me. I am intrigued to try these. So, sorry, it's rubbish down there now. Um, what the hell? They're huge. So, um, I've tried the, I accidentally got these wrong when I got open, open them. These aren't peach. They are apricot. apricot. And I knew that, I just said it wrong. There you go. It's so big. Look at the size of that bad boy. It's like the size of a ping pong ball. It is. Yeah. Cool. I can't bite it. It's not chewy, it's harder to, it's solid. That's the inside. So it's not fresh. It's not fresh apricot. A lot more chocolate with this one. It has to have more chocolate though to encase it. That really hurt my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> the front of my teeth look feel like they're falling out. With the smaller ones, I could eat them all day long. These seem to be not as Moorish. But I, for me, I prefer these because I don't think you get as much. That's it's not true. so much overload. Yeah, which is weird because there's more of it. I think the, but I think it's the chocolate to fruit ratio is a bit different. They're so good though. Mm -hmm. So good. Last one. Last one. There we go. Now, I am hoping. With these, I'm hoping I get the zing and the pot and the punch that I didn't get with the Daryl Lee. We shall see. Mm. Are these small again? Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. they look the same as the, as the mango. Yeah. But obviously with white chocolate. They smell really nice. I've got to, I'm still finishing the, uh, Apricot one. I think you are going to get the zing because I can smell it through the white chocolate. I so hope so. Hang on. Okay. I'm desperately hoping. Ready? Mm-hmm. It's just like, pow. Not quite as much as the mango and the apricot, but a lot more than the Daryl Lee. It's not overpowering though. It's not quite as much, like I said, as, as the apricot and mango. But it's more than they'd already. Just to let you know. What? 
What? In your own time, we're filming. They are. All of them are apricots. Are they? What? No. So, I'm really surprised. These are sumptuous, tangy, real apricot scents mixed with a sweet, natural raspberry flavour. It's not a raspberry. I've been conned. We're not eating raspberries. We're eating apricots with I've, just a bit of raspberry flavour. I've been absolutely conned. I need to get the mango ones now. Don't be wrong. They're still incredible. Um, oh, these are these are mango and apricot combined. Okay. So it's just raspberry strange flavouring. Let me see what the inside's like on this. Quite. But I guess dried raspberries. It's not the same texture as a dried apricot and mango. Still amazing. I said I prefer the fruit shops because I want that fruit buzz. These are my favourite. I'm just trying to think of how many words and how many ways I can say zing and... Buzz. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. Really good. Good. Mm, okay. Not a bad selection at all. I really like it. I would eat yeah. everything here. Yeah. Let me know. Which of these haven't you tried? Have you tried the fruit chocs from South, South Australia? These are both new. Have you tried the new Daryl Lee products? Which one's your favourite? Let us know in the comments down below and we will catch you next time. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.